six short years ago, the prospects for a bipartisan solution to America's broken immigration system seemed bleak. <clears throat> Despite support from congressional Democrats and a Republican president, an immigration reform proposal that had been defeated on a procedure vote in the Adventist, let's say that again, Mr. President. <clears throat> Despite support from congressional Democrats <clears throat> and a Republican president, we couldn't get enough Republicans in the Senate to move forward on a reform proposal that had been defeated, I repeat, Mr. President, on a procedural vote in here in the Senate. <clears throat> but one man who was a longtime member of the Judiciary Committee and had been chairman of the Immigration Subcommittee, Immigration for decades, Senator Ted Kennedy, reminded us all that the reform for which he fought so hard would pass one day. And that day could not be far off. This is what he said when that bill was defeated. <clears throat> Quote, America always finds a way to solve its problems, expand its frontiers, and move closer to its ideals. It is not always easy, but it is an American story. It's an American way. I believe we will soon succeed where we failed today, that we will enact the kind of comprehensive reform that our ideals and our national security demand. Ted Kennedy said that in 2007. Mr. President, he always spoke from back here, and I can still hear his booming voice. I can hear him saying this. <clears throat> Our friend Ted Kennedy was right, and I believe the time for common sense immigration reform has come. I'm sorry that Senator Kennedy is not alive to see the widespread bipartisan support for the legislation being considered today in the Judiciary Committee. Legislation I will shortly bring before the full Senate. Senator Kennedy would be very satisfied with the efforts of the Gang of Eight, four Democrats and four Republicans. Even though Ted Kennedy was known as one of America's great progressives, his, his legacy is that he worked with liberals, conservatives, independents, he worked with everyone to get things done. He always was willing to set aside partisanship. And that's what the Gang of Eight has done, and that's why he would like it so much. And this Gang of Eight has done it in addressing a critical issue facing our nation. And he would applaud the diligent work of the Senate Judiciary Committee under the leadership of his longtime friend. They served together in that committee for, oh, gee, it must be four decades, Mr. President. Kennedy and Leahy, they did a lot of work together. And Senator Leahy has done so much in this committee work that he's done the last several weeks to refine and perfect the Gang of Eight's reasonable proposal. So it's gratifying to see the momentum behind common sense reforms that will make our country safer and help 11 million undocumented immigrants get right with the law.